I call me Black Rainbow and you can call me Black Rainbow. Um, many cuties will ask why I need to learn so many proportions or I can draw anything even I don't know any proportion. Yes, if you are happy in drawing, you don't need to know so many rules and knowledge. But if you still watch this video, it means that you actually care about this issue, right? So today I will introduce the three kinds of proportion to you and it will help you when you are drawing. Okay, in here, I want to introduce you the first proportion is golden ratio. Maybe you already know about this when you are in math class or art class. But in here, I still want to remind you what is this. It is come from Euclid. He defined the golden ratio is long section to short section equal for length to long section. It is just like this picture. You can see AC to BC equal X to 1. Okay, in here you will say, Oh my god, what is this? It is not math class. Why you tell me about this? It's, it is not about drawing or anime painting. Yes, I know, but if you know what the secret about this letter, you will know why this ratio is really help you to draw anime drawing. Because on the other words, this proportion is 1 to 1.618. And what it means? Okay, we can see where we can see the golden ratio. Okay, now you can see the Venus statue, right? The head to belly band and the belly band to solar foot. The proportion is 1 to 1.618, right? If you use this proportion to your character design, it is really useful, right? And you also can see the effort tower. The proportion is also the 1 to 1.618. It's really amazing, right? And you can see great tempo. The high to west, just the same. And you also can see the violin. The proportion is hidden in the design of the violin. So in here, we know the golden ratio is really, really useful to us to uh, design the character or building or you join temple even you decide a instrument or weapon so we can see where we can use god ratio in here the example is the building and character design so the next time if you want to design a building or character design you can use golden ratio and the second golden ratio is spiral it is really interesting it's like this you can see this picture a lot of golden ratio combined is like this and it can become a spiral so in here you may think okay so what is this and how can i use the spiral ratio to painting let's take a look where we can see the golden ratio spiral in here, yes, it's just like uh, you can see like in galaxy or typhoon like this. But you also can see the spirals in like the picture like a uh, rose or hippocampus or shell, even the Mona Lisa picture. See? So in here you will know Yes, this spiral ratio can use to composition or painting spiral composition. And you will say, okay, so just that's it? Of course not. So where we can use golden ratio spiral? Okay, in here you can see when you take a picture, of course you can use this ratio. 
or even you want to design a logo you can use this because sometimes if you want to design a logo you need to draw a curve and in here you can use the spiral ratio on your design of course if you want to draw a rose or shell of course you can use it and when I think about the spiral ratio, I just think of the spiral pill in Naruto. So it is so funny and I find this picture, you see? This is Boruto. And the funny thing is you can see when I put the spiral ratio on this picture, it's just fit on it. So in here you can see it's just like uh, the picture use the spiral ratio and they draw this composition right amazing so if you want to draw a picture or you want to draw an illustration you can use the spiral ratio on your composition design the third is silver ratio and what is this because a lot of people don't know what is this and they even didn't heard the silver ratio okay in here silver ratio is that the ratio of the short side to the long side of the isosceles right triangle so it is just like a 1 to 1.414 okay and in here you will say okay so I don't know what is this Let's just see where we can see the silver ratio. Usually people use silver ratio around their life, just like a A4, F3, F5 paper. It's like a postcard, or you want to print a paper, or like a poster. This is the silver ratio. And usually it's used in the Eastern country because a long time ago, a lot of people use the wood to build a building, like a house or a temple, even in the China or Japan. And when people want to make the wood become rectangle, it would be half the silver ratio. That's why usually people use silver ratio is in Eastern countries. And you can see in this picture, it's a Japan temple and they use the silver ratio to design the temple. Okay, but nowadays what the thing we can see the silver ratio, see, it's so cute, right? Actually, Japanese use this silver ratio to design the cute character, just like a Pom Pom Puran and Hello Kitty. And even you can see the Hello Kitty head is also designed by silver ratio right so in here it is so interesting because if you want to use the silver ratio to draw something you better use to design a cute character okay after introducing those ratios when you are drawing a picture which ratio would you use to help you draw the feeling you want of course, those ratios are not absolute rule. It shouldn't be a stumbling block that hinders you to create. So you still can make changes according to your needs. Okay, so if you have any problem, please don't be shy, comment below. And don't forget to subscribe and open the bell. So what if I have a new video release? you will get a reminder. In the end, let me bring a little color to your life.